Kids, don't smoke cigarettes, blow bubbles. All right, so I recently mastered the Invisible Step Challenge. So I'm just gonna keep mastering a bunch of cool things on the internet. I just saw a really cool video about making ice bubbles. It is freezing in New York right now. There's a storm called the Bomb Cyclone, and I thought, why not recreate that video? Warning, I'm not crafty at all, so if I can do this, anyone can. I think all you need is a uh, straw and some soap. Shouldn't be too hard. Got soap. Do you have a straw back here? No. Alvin, do you know where I can find a straw? Next to the drinks, that's where straws are. Oh, over there? Got my straws. Now I just need to find a good little patch of snow. This seems like a pretty good patch of snow right here. I saw the video. It looked like you kind of just get some soap in the tube. So that worked. Now, I think what you do is you get low to the ground. Oh, should have worn gloves. I think you just blow. Yeah, that didn't seem to work whatsoever. <laughs> I failed miserably. It's okay. Life is built on failures and then you go and you succeed and you work hard and that's the message of this video. So I did some research. I figured out what I need is a bowl and a spoon. All right, that shouldn't be too hard. 30 milliliters of warm water, 35 milliliters of corn syrup, 35 milliliters of dish soap, 2 tablespoons of sugar, one plastic straw. And that's it. So I'm gonna go to Tasty and I'm gonna steal a bunch of their stuff. That's corn syrup? Yeah. Only issue is they don't really have regular sugar. Oh, there's real sugar back there? Thank you. So I got all the ingredients. I need to make like a tasty setup, like a little top-down thing. You know what, screw it. You can just record me. So I need 200 milliliters of warm water. Which way is warm on a sink? Up or down? I've only used left and right sinks. Good enough. Next, this is like the shittest episode of Chopped you've ever seen. 35 milliliters of corn syrup. There's no even 35 milliliter thing. How am I supposed to know? Ew, what is corn syrup? Can you drink corn syrup? Not good. I need another measuring cup because now this one's sticky. Oh my God, I hate cooking. Another measuring cup. I need dish soap. I forgot my dish soap. I left it outside. That looks like 35. I need another measuring cup. I need to measure the sugar. Oh my God. Make sure if you guys want to make these bubbles, you have a lot of measuring cups. So I need uh, two tablespoons. I don't need a measuring cup. Tea tablespoon. That's a teaspoon, man. You got me a, a teaspoon. teaspoon. Just scoop it out. <laughs> <laughs> he told me to scoop the sugar instead of um, pouring it out and we're done What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna find a patch of ice first because in the video It was like on an icy surface. So I'm gonna see if that works So we got this nice little beautiful patch of ice right here All right, so I added some more soap. Let's see how this works. I'm making bubbles. It is time to get some bubbles on the ice patch. Why can't you just freeze this bubble? Ah, why, why, why? Even though it seemed like all hope was lost, I was not going to give up. I decided I was gonna stay outside till I made the perfect ice bubble. It started to storm, but I kept blowing bubbles. Bubbles kept popping and popping, but I kept blowing and they kept popping and I kept blowing and then finally this happened. I gave up. I didn't really give up. I, I just, it's freezing outside so I'm not gonna keep trying and failing. I don't know what I'm doing so I decided I'm gonna call the guy who actually made the bubble video and he's gonna tell me how to do it. Hello, it's good to meet you. You as well. So you made the bubble video? I did. Where did you actually blow the bubbles? In southern Alberta. I've been trying for a long time to figure out how to do it and I failed miserably, so how did, how did you do it? I was using um, a soap bubble solution. I was using a mixture of dish soap, corn syrup, as well as a little bit of sugar. That's exactly what I have. And I was blowing the bubbles using a straw from McDonald's. So I was dipping the straw. That's what it was. In southern Alberta, we had a temperature, it was about minus 25 on that day. I need about minus, minus 20 Celsius. What's really been awesome this year, so many people have been freezing bubbles, it's been fun. You think I can, I can do it today? I think you can do it today. That didn't sound very confident. <laughs> 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 no! So I now know how to make an ice bubble, which is awesome. The only problem is that the circumstances aren't right. It's way too windy outside and it's actually getting warmer in New York. I can't believe how hard it is to make a bubble. I can't give up. A freezer. Bye buddy, stay warm. I hope he fucking freezes. Yeah, 
so this trend is definitely very difficult. So if you're like me, don't try it. On a difficulty scale from zero to 10, I would give this about a, uh, a, a seven. Also, it's very uncomfortable to be cold for that long. So I'm gonna bump that up to an eight. Eight out of 10 difficulty, don't try it if you're like me. If you guys liked the video, let me know in the comments below what you want me to try and master next.